The time came for Mary and Joseph to do what the law of Moses says a mother is supposed to do after her baby is born. They took Jesus to the temple in Jerusalem and presented him to the Lord. Just as the law of the Lord says, each firstborn baby boy belongs to the Lord. The law of the Lord also says that parents have to offer a sacrifice, giving at least a pair of doves or two young pigeons. So that is what Mary and Joseph did. At this time, a man named Simeon was living in Jerusalem. Simeon was a good man. He loved God and was waiting for God to save the people of Israel. God's Spirit came to him and told him that he would not die until he had seen Christ the Lord. When Mary and Joseph brought Jesus to the temple to do what the law of Moses says should be done for a new baby, the Spirit told Simeon to go into the temple. Simeon took the baby Jesus in his arms and praised God. Lord, I am your servant, and now I can die in peace because you have kept your promise to me. With my own eyes I have seen what you have done to save your people, and foreign nations will also see this. Your mighty power is a light for all nations, and it will bring honor to your people Israel. Jesus' parents were surprised at what Simeon had said. Then he blessed them and told Mary, this child of yours will cause many people in Israel to fall and others to stand. The child will be like a warning sign. Many people will reject him and you, Mary, will suffer as though you had been stabbed by a dagger. But all this will show what people are really thinking.